Uh, I look at the game tonight, and I want to first of all congratulate Georgia, man. I thought uh, they, they, they're a strong team and in all three phases. I think they play, they play hard. Um, they don't make a lot of mistakes. Uh, I thought tonight they had a lot of the things really had more to do with us than, than really Georgia. Um, I thought, you know, we, we did a we did a solid job, like in the first half. I thought, I thought. Uh, Key play for us in that first half was was probably um, the third and one and fourth and one, and not converting on those opportunities. Um, you know, for us, we 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 knew the margin for error um, and was slim. Uh, felt like on the fourth and one, uh, I'd rather make them go to the long field. Uh, it's a choice between the points and taking the long field, but I thought I, had, I didn't know how many more times we'd have an opportunity to get down there, but. Uh, I hope, man, that that would spark us a little bit. And really, um, I mean, I thought our guys battled in the first half. Um, I, I, I told some people, I mean, I believe in this football team, it's got good players, but we've got some ones and some threes right now. I mean, we don't quite have a two unit. And um, that, that, that shows at times. Um, as I looked at the first half, I thought we allowed Fran to get hot um, just right before half. I thought we played a good quarter and 12 minutes of football, and then we take uh, in the three minutes and allow uh, him to get hot. I thought, um, and our defense just wore down in the second half. I didn't think we started it right, but I just didn't think we we, we, we had enough juice and enough energy. And, you know, I mean, as I look at it, um, you know, I, I learned a lot about this football team. I think they came out, I think they competed the right way. Um, it's not what we wanted. It's not what we wanted, but that's why, I mean, you keep developing. We know we know where we have to go from here. Um, Real, real sloppy football on both sides tonight. I think there were 14 penalties by us, 15 penalties by them. Um, that's not the type of football I mean, that we want to play. And it's not winning football when you're on the road. Uh, the winning team can do that. The losing team cannot do that. And so, with that being the case, we've got to fix that. But, you know, overall, I, I'm, not, I'm, I'm not worried or deterred. Uh, I mean, I've been here before, and what I do know is that uh, I mean, I've got something to work with. I just got to make sure I mean, that I can fine tune it as we get ready to uh, move past this game and move on to Florida. But again, you know, my hats off to Georgia. Uh, they're, they're a really good football team. Uh, they they made plays when they needed to. We leaked in the past game. Um, I thought for the most part early in the game and we stopped the run, but you know, I mean, too many late yards in this ball game to, to, to uh, say, man, that it was a, a, a good outing at all. I just think uh, I learned a lot about my football team that I can build on. And I told them in the locker room, we gotta, we gotta Turn around fast, look at the tape, uh, clean it up, and and not let this one affect us next week. We need to play our best ball next week. So with that being said, I'll open up for questions. The difference between the ones and the threes, where do you think that's hurting you most, not having the, those solid twos? Well, I, I think, you know, when you talk about that, um, it's it's just the idea of young guys tackling. I thought we tackled better tonight, but I think, you know, I mean, young guys, you know, tackling, and I think at the end of the day, just really having a, 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 an understanding of playing fast and playing football in the SEC. You know, when you're growing up, you know, I mean, young guys. You know, for example, I mean, you're missing Charles Wright tonight. Um, I mean, you're missing you're you're missing Lewis Vecchio. You know, I mean, so you're 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 having younger defenders, uh, you know, on the edge or inside. And you know, I mean, what happens with that is that you know, I mean, those guys, if they misfit something, the ball gets out. So, you know, we're, we're already playing with, you know, with young backers inside at times. And so with that being the case, you know, it's like popcorn. You know, you're trying to, you're trying to make sure that you can minimize the damage. But again, I, I, think, I think that's, that's not why we were, where we were tonight. I think at the end of the day, uh, you know, when we wore down, um, and we, we didn't tackle well. Too many explosives earlier on, like in this ball game. And, uh, and it, it, just, it just wanted to been, you know, a little bit of popcorn. But, those are things that can be fixed. Good chance both of those guys can get back next week, Vecchio and Wright. They'll actually both be back next week, okay. you know, which is great for us. I think at the end of the day, I mean, you want to you want to have all your guys, but um, you know when you're missing, you know, with two veteran players that, that that can set edges, that can rush, that can strong enough to stay in gaps, especially versus a team like this. I think uh, you know it does make a difference. But you know, for us, uh, again, we still got to play the game. We're, we don't make any excuses, man. We line up, we play football, just wasn't good enough tonight. You explained why you went for it on fourth and one. The, the play call, is that looking back, was there a good thought behind that? There was some misdirection, motion to the left, run up the middle. Did you like the play call? Yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, for us, uh, we, we, had a, we, had a, we had a guard miss a blocking assignment. Anytime you let leakage, okay, I mean, you get vertical penetration, it winds up being a tackle for a loss. 
I mean, again, I mean, you you you, you call things because you believe that you have the opportunity to get it done, and you know, I mean, when you don't, uh, then it's on you. I mean, you know, whether whether you run it, don't get it, or you throw it, and don't get it. You know, really, what it comes down to is that you didn't get it. We sh we should have executed better on that play. You know, but that's on us. Um, that's on those guys. You know, but up front, that's their job. Uh, you know, man, to give us uh, at least the line of scrimmage, and the backs got to get one. It seemed like Riley kind of bounced back a bit in the game. What you kind of see from him, not making two field goals or? I thought Riley had a great night. I mean, I, I I told him, you know, I had confidence in him. You know, going throughout the week, I told him, you know, we don't overkick this week. You know, because he's he's one who tends to overkick. So um, he took minimal kicks. I thought he was on on uh, you know most of the game. And if I had more opportunities down there, he probably would have got a lot more kicks. What's the way that Kyle plays, just in general, knowing that he's getting a lot of pressure, a lot of defenders in back, just the way he kind of handled a lot of tonight, not making a lot of mistakes. <coughs> yeah, you know, I mean, the bright spot, you know, is that we didn't turn the ball over. Yeah. You know, um, obviously, you 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 think you have a chance to stay in the game. You know, whenever you don't turn the ball over, and that's part of part partially why we were in the game the first half, because you know, but we didn't turn the ball over and we were moving it. Um, so uh, a lot, a lot's on his plate. He's got to get it right. Uh, Curry got a little dinged up. Pate went out for a second, and you know, in terms of rhythm, you sort of felt rhythm you sort of get disrupted a little bit, and you're sort of searching, trying to find right combinations to get get uh, you know Kalaja uh, in the ball, but Kalaja saw double coverage most of the night, so. It, it, it was interesting. I mean, I thought I thought Kyle handled himself the right way. Um, I know his frustration set in later, but for the most part, I mean, he did exactly what we needed him to do. Keyshawn had the long run, didn't get many carries in the first half after that. But it looked like he he blew a couple of pass protections. Is that is that what keeps him off the field at times? The pass protection? No, I, I, I think all those guys are learning pass protection. Carr's just done more of it. You know, like the reality is, you know, like the only way that you're going to get better. Like in pass pro to be able to do it. So, uh, you know, with with Kari, with Jamari, and and, and with Key, you know, it, it's it's definitely about understanding, standing the protections, holding up in protections. That's what we work on every week. And obviously, Kari's the best at it, but because he's had four years of of experience, so you know, uh, he'll continue to get better. You said the last two weeks you're a little concerned about the mindset. Tonight, I'm hearing more just. Issues physically, yeah. guys beat up, that sort of thing. Is that is that fair that it's it's not mindset this week? It, it wasn't mindset. I mean, we came into this game the right way. I think I think we went after it the right way. I think you know, really for us, um, you you, you got to stay ahead of the change. Like I said, you know, we penalties in the second half hurt us, um, miscues, uh, you know, defensively, you know, explosive plays, not finishing on tackle, things that. That, that that start to you know show when you're a tired football uh, from the team you know, late in the second half even you know, to me just 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 really kept showing itself again and again and again so uh, we're we're gonna be fine um, I, I felt different about this game than I did you know in other games I truly I truly saw it through a different lens tonight I tried to you know be a little more composed or as composed as I could be but. You know, I, I I saw some different things in this ball game. I know where we can get better. I know where we have to get better, and that's my job as the head coach to make sure I address it. Do you mean you were, you were quieter on the sideline? You watched more? Can you explain a little bit? No, just I'm just I'm just talking about. I saw I saw it through a different gaze. I I looked. I I saw you know uh, consistency at times, and I saw a breakdown at times. I saw it all. I saw the popcorn. Uh, I I saw where guys could have strained more. I saw where guys didn't. Didn't uh, or, or, or some guys did strain, and, and other guys, you know, I mean, at times just 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 gave solid effort, not great effort. So again, all those things is different. Sometimes I see it, sometimes I don't. Tonight, I man, I saw it a little more, um, a little clearer. And now what we have to do is uh, get back to work because believe me, we get back at about 1:15 or 1:30. So uh, I'll be watching the game on the flight, and, and then hopefully, man, I mean, I'll get to uh, Florida as soon as I get home. Question. Thank you, Coach. Thanks. Thanks, Derek. Give me just a second with players. I'll get one. You know you're getting one.